this <laughs> all right, this is just me, you know, making it a making a raw review for you guys. Um this this started off with Seth Rollins coming to the ring, you know, turning back from um from extreme rules, you know, where he where he pedigreed um Roman Reigns after the match after after his match against AJ Styles. So, you know, he came back and started talking about, you know, the, the chance cheer for him, you know, at first when he came into the ring, he missed him and stuff like that. And then Seth Rollins was saying that welcome back and all of that, you know, it took him about seven days to come back from an injury and stuff like that. Then he turned between his phase where he was talking about, you know, everybody would give me emails, flowers and stuff like that. They were sending him on his Twitter page, you know, with Seth Rollins, you know, say he I throw them in the tray and he turned it heel again. Talking about, I don't need all your help. I don't need you fans. I don't need nobody to help me out when it comes to the championship. That was what Rollins was talking about. You know, at first, you know, he was talking about a lot of stuff. You know, and, and stuff like that. So, you know, the, the, the he talking about, you know, he never lost the WWE championship while he was injured, you know, for 207 days. You know, 207 days, you know, there was Seth Rollins, the whole day Seth Rollins missed while, you know, um, Roman Reigns with WWE Championship, you know, and Triple H. So, you know, and then, and then he was trying to reveal to Stephen McMahon, you know, the Stephen McMahon did not appreciate the hug, appreciate the hug, then, then out of there, you know, things had changed right here, so, <coughs> you know, and stuff like that. You know, and then Stephen McMahon was talking about, her partnership with Steph Rollins and stuff like that, and then Steph McMahon shook her hand and stuff like that. Out of the, you know, the Roman Reigns came out to, to Steph Rollins, you know, trying to confront him, and then Steph Rollins, you know, just got out of the ring and stuff like that. And then, you know, they were, he was talking about a lot of stuff that he don't need a fan. And then, you know, Steph Rollins was saying that, you know, he, he was saying that, you calling me the weakest link at the championship. You was waiting on me to, to lose the WWE championship to somebody. That was Seth Rollins was saying to the fans and all of them. Roman Reigns came out there trying to get his revenge on Seth Rollins for what he did to him at Extreme Rules and stuff like that. So, and then Shane McMahon came out there, gave him a little pep talk about the WWE championship. You know, they said Shane McMahon was telling Seth Rollins that, you know, you never lost a WWE Championship, which I can understand, Shane. You know, and then he told Roman Reigns, well, you know, you the WWE Championship, he, he go go away. Then they announced, well, you know, it's going to be Seth Rollins. Shane McMahon said it's going to be Seth Rollins versus Roman Reigns for the WWE Championship at, um, at Money in the Bank, which coming up in June. So um, then it was um, The Miz versus... Um, the men and the march were doing their interview at first, you know, and then it was it was, it was Maurice was, was telling her men about the end of, she was she her best husband is the Intercontinental Championship. And then the men were saying the same way. That they was they were they were from the tongue kiss until Cesaro came out there. Then there was Cesaro versus the Miz. Good match, or there was a good match there, you know, on and off. The men versus Mar, that was a good match, you know, and all, you know, Cesaro won for the um, money in the bank, you know, qualification. So, Cesaro won. Then it was, um, who else? Then it was the New Day, you know, celebrating Raw anniversary, 1,200 days of Raw. Until, you know, the, the, the big, he was trying to throw the cake at somebody at first. He was trying to throw the cake at JBL, you know. Michael Cole and Brian Staxton, you know, they didn't work. Then the social outcast started attacking the New Day on Raw tonight, you know, then I did then it was the New Day versus the Social Outcast. Good match, or you know, it wasn't I never really cared for, you know, the New Day won the match. And then that day, you know, the one of the New Day members hit it um uh, hit he Slater with the cake, you know, they hit him with, him with the cake, and they, they, they throw cake all over his face. Then that day, the new day, you know, walked away. So they walked away after that, so. I, I, I said it to Stephanie already, so. 
they know what they, they know what the return of John Cena that Monday night on Raw. You know, I seen that already tonight. He was training, ready to come back. I haven't seen John Cena in a while, you know, since that soldier soldier in, but he will be back next Monday. Uh, then it was um, Dolph Ziggler challenged Byron Corbin next week, next Monday on Raw. The interview was in interview with Byron Corbin where, where he did the Dolph Ziggler on Extreme Rule, you know, that the fans had a problem with it. And then Byron Corbin said he don't care what the fans think or don't like. That was Byron Corbin saying that Dolph Ziggler did his interview on behalf, you know, about a techno match and stuff like that, talking about. You're gonna have a match with me next week, Byron Corbin on Monday Night Raw. There was there was Dolph Ziggler told uh, Byron Corbin. Then, then that that <coughs> you know, then that that it was Apollo Crews was doing the interview with the girl back then to shame was attacking from behind. I don't know why for some reason, but you know, the, I guess he was talking about the new era. Apollo Crews said then Shane was attacking from behind and stuff like that. Then it was it was Chris Jericho versus Apollo Crews. Good match, but you know Chris Jericho won, you know, because Shane was attacking uh, Apollo Crews from behind because of that. So, but Chris Jericho won the match against Apollo Crews. That was a good match there. Then it was Enzo Amara return from injury, you know, with Cass. So they they were celebrating and Cass was saying that he had to pay medical bills. You know, he, he had to just he talked about sustaining from a head in which what's happened from the Vado Villains versus Enzo and Cass match back in um I think back uh payback I think yeah, I think payback. So, um there was Enzo and Cass were talking, so then it was um Big Cass versus Bubba Ray Doug. It was Big Cass with Enzo Enzo Amar versus uh, Bubba Ray with Bernard Devon as his manager sidekick. Good match, you know, then. That was what funny was, you know, Devon knocked that um, Enzo from behind. So then, then Big K got even thrown um, Enzo to uh, Devon. So that was, a, you know, that was a good match there, you know, but Big K won the match against Bubba Ray. Um, then it was, um, who else? Then it was Sami Zayn versus Sheamus. Tight match there, that was tight. But, you know, Sami Zayn won the match to qualify for the, for the money in the bank. Um, who else? Uh, then it was, um, then it was, a uh, Dean Ambrose versus Dolph Ziggler. Um, that was okay match, you know, that was an okay match there. That was a hundred percent okay. Uh but Dean Ambrose won the match to to give um to give Dolph Ziggler <coughs> the um the 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 uh the D D T, the D D S, you know, something like that. The dirty D the after this. So but Dean Ambrose won the match. Then it was then it was AJ Styles, you know, Talking about what happened during the match, if it wasn't for the match against Roman Reigns, you know, if it wasn't for you know the Usos and the Bullet Club, you know, he would have won that match. And then the Bullet Club came out there and started talking to AJ about what you talking about. You didn't need or 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 the Usos for winning that match. We were trying to help you out, AJ. That was that was what he was talking about. Then they in they, they were talking about other stuff that I don't remember about. So, you know, then, then they split up from each other, so, after that, you know, you know, he, didn't, he don't need your help no more, but we don't, like, that was AJ Styles coming to the Bullet Club, you know, then the Bullet Club left, and that was that, you know, they didn't need each other anymore. Then it was, um, AJ Styles versus Kevin, the one the main event for the national qualification. Um... That was a good match. I got to get 100% effort on that. But AJ Styles is really losing lately. I don't know why, you know. I'm going to talk about that in my next video tomorrow, hopefully. I just put an antivirus on this tablet, so. But I will be talking about what they'll be bringing down lately. I will be talking about that, about releasing the Cody Rose and stuff like that. I will be doing that. So. Then it was AJ Styles versus Kevin Owens. That was a good match. That was 100% effort. Good match. 
hundred percent effort, good match. You know, hundred percent effort. Um, that was a good match, there. You know, that was a impressive. That, that, that's the that's the only match that I like. Where the AJ Styles versus Kevin, that's the only match that I like. That was very impressive. Oh, uh, Kevin Owens won the match. You know, Kevin Owens won the match against AJ Styles. I really wanted AJ to win, but you know, Kevin Owens won anyway. But let's get into Ric Flair and um, Charlotte and Dana Dana Brooks situation. You know, uh, Charlotte did her that it was flat bad. You know, but I know it was fake, but it was bad. But Ric Flair was crying at first. You know, about 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 her about about, about Ric Flair and being there for her and stuff like that. You know, and then Charlotte Charlotte really hurt Ric Flair. And Ric Flair was started fake crying in the ring and stuff. Ric Flair, you gonna cry? You want to kiss you? That was uh, Charlotte said, you know, to Ric Flair, you know, how much he never been there for her. You know, he been there for your matches. Why are you upset with what happened years ago while he was going down the road? If you're a professional wrestler, you you got to go out. You got to you you got to go out. You know, I know I know he wasn't there for you, but. That is that that's just the way professional wrestlers jobs. You know, they they go out and they go they go around the world and fight for their life to take care of their children and stuff, you know. But, you know, Charlie, you know, kick kick them out of the ring and stuff like that, you know, talking about her mom and stuff like that, doing a good job. And she said it was friend to do a good job, then that that, you know, Charlie kicked Rick Flair out of the ring. And stuff like that, and so I said, "Oh yeah, yeah, oh." So I can't remember. So the Rick Flair, you know, talking to with Renee Young, and oh, the whole rap was was celebrating. We feel going out like the Titus O'Neil, Aaron Anderson, and I think Old Becky Lynch was standing on behalf of the hallway and stuff like that. And the Rick Flair, you know, exit. That was that, you know, that was it. But this is that's it, you know, but. This is uh, Justin Williams, you know, feel free to rate, comment, and subscribe, and add me on Facebook. I'm out, people. WWE Raw was okay, you know, but I liked the last match between AJ and uh, AJ Styles and Kevin Owens. I liked that match. But now, it's Kevin Owens, Chris Jericho, uh, Dean Ambrose. Um, Kevin Owens, Chris Jericho, Dean Ambrose, Cesaro. And um and um who else? Sami Zayn gonna be at the um Money in the Bank pay per view in June facing off each other. I don't know who the other two are. I don't know, but let's find out on SmackDown or Raw which 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 way it's gonna be. But that's it, you know. But this is just the Williams, you know. Feel free to rate, comment, and subscribe, and. Add me on Facebook. I'm out. Peace. I will be making another video about the situation tomorrow. I'm out. Peace.